Another training session for John Paul Clues at Mickey's Boxing Gym near Barnsley. You wouldn't think it to look at him, but this 30-year-old lean, mean fighting machine once looked very different, battling with depression and obesity. Brought on by family bereavement, Paul found himself in a bad place and decided he must do something to turn his life around. I just buried it under the carpet, but obviously you buried too much, it starts coming back out, doesn't it? So, and I just locked my son away from everyone, really, that way. Just closed on everyone. Got up to nearly 19 stone from started running one mile, two mile, three mile. Got myself up to about 15 to 18 miles a week, you know, and then that's when I got myself into a good place. Got, I had a few friends that invited me down to, to, to Mickey's gym. Met Josh and Mick, you know, and then it just got a bond instantly and it just went from there. Slowly but surely, the structure to his life the gym gave him became an addiction and started to show positive results. It's my second home. It's the only way I feel I can be me, you know what I mean? Here and home, obviously with my kids. It's my second home, I love it coming here. I'd live here if Josh let me. <laughs> Under the wing of champion boxer Josh Whale and his dad Mick, Paul's potential started to shine through. When he first walked in gym, um, you know, at 19 stone, it, it, were, it were a big ask. Um, he wanted that structure, what we gave him. But, you know, Paul's proved what you can do with a bit of hard work and you can change your life and that's what boxing clubs just like this there's, these are all over the country you know that can do that john paul clues had his first professional light heavyweight fight in november and won his debut he's also created his own diet and fitness plans that people can sign up to helping others reach their potential is important to him you just got to get get out get get out of bed get off city get up, whatever you're doing get up get out there even if it's for a walk you know or a little run just got to do it it's, it's, only, it's the only way you can do it. You can't, you can't lay there and wait for other people to come and change your life for you. You've got to do it yourself. With a three-year contract and five fights scheduled so far this year, this once unhealthy, unmotivated young man certainly has a bright future ahead of him. <laughs> Ian White, BBC Look North, Barnsley. Congratulations to him. I think my New Year's resolution will be to learn to read the autocue properly now.